Hello everyone, welcome to my plot club course and for now I'm going to show you how to install Flutter in macOS um, so first you need to head into the Flutter um, official website um, here click in the installation and here you can choose your operating system if you're using window you click here and if you're using Mac you click here but for this video I'm going to show you how to install in Mac OS um, after you come in here you need to scroll down and read the documentation how to get start in the Flutter SDK so first you need to click here is um, to download the zip file so I already have downloaded the file and when you download it um, um, as you go to the place that you download the file that you save your download then unzip it and after you unzip it you will see something like this inside your file then the most important part here is to export the path to global so here to export the path to the global so you can run your flutter your flutter command from anywhere you are in the pc in your pc so here you can type nano bash profile this Sorry. Nano. Ash. Profile like this. Uh, and then, and then you copy. Uh, and then you copy the flutter here. For the path here, you can. I'll 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 leave this command um, below the description so you can just copy and paste inside your um, um, git um, nano bash, and your nano bash might look um, different from mine because um, it's I'm 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 customized. I'm cost it is a customized environment for each developer. And after you you download it and you export the path and the next thing that you do you need to type a flutter doctor because uh, flutter dot doctor um, it show you like what uh, the process of your installation of flutter it will give you feedback like what you have and what you doesn't have and what you need to um, download more to to get some more stuff to get it done. Um, so for Flutter Doctor, you you need to wait a while until this finish. Um, so I just pause it here and I'll come back when it's done. Um, you can also after install it, you can also test it like um, you check the version of the Flutter. Is Flutter dash dash version to make sure that you have installed the flutter and if you are installed successfully it will give you this command and if it said something else then this may be your uh, your unsuccessfully installed flutter you need to uh, follow the the step again and flutter is a uh, is a framework or uh, that Google create where um, we can create um, iOS and Android app by using one code base so it is kind of advantage first but yeah so in here if you want to this is for Mac only if you want to um, like um, test your code in 
um, iOS device, you need an Xcode and how to install Xcode here is to go to App Store Oops, sorry go to App Store and click search for Xcode and it's free, you can download it since I have it, I'm not going to download it so you can download uh, the Xcode here and, and then and then you can you can test um, the app that you are creating in the simulator in Xcode. Uh, wait, let me click here. Oops, sorry. Um, Code developer to simulator. Yeah, you can test your app here as a simulator, as an iOS app. So I'm gonna leave it here. Um, so you need to follow the procedure how to install the Xcode. It's easy. Just um, go to App Store and download it. And and if you want to create an Android app, you need to install Android Studio. To install Android Studio. Um, for further ref ref reference for the Android part is to install the Android Studio. So you're gonna you're going to download it. Just uh, go to the official website and download the Android Studio. Since I have it, I'm not gonna download it again. You need to download it and then you need to open the android studio you can test the app on android on android device just like ios device your app is running on the stimulator like this so i'm gonna quit it since it's just an introduction so i'm gonna move forward to the the next important part of, of our like, process is the code editor so for for some people they they use um, Android Studio but for this course I'm going to use uh, Visual Studio code because it's simple it's easy to, to to get it so you can go online and type Visual Studio code you can download it from the official website here it's a really cool code base code, ed uh, code editor here you can click it download here and after you finish your download you go to Visual Studio Code mm, and you need to install uh, oops uh, this is my leftover project let me open the new one. Okay, so this is the Visual Code Studio. Uh, so after here, you need to install. After coming here, you need to install two part. Here, click the extension or click here the extension to download Flutter here, click here to type Flutter here I'm sorry here you download the yeah you download the Flutter here So you finish download here and you're gonna you're gonna need to download another part inside the extension of the Visual Code Studio is um, Dart. You need to install Dart and that's it. That's the environment that you need to create for the 
to create Flutter, Flutter app. And I'm going to show you how to run a command that create an app for you. So in here, um, cd to the working folder of yours. Uh, here I'm just gonna say Flutter create my first app and enter um, Flutter going to create an app for you it's, um, it's fast okay so the, uh, the it, it's finished my first app so you're gonna drag it put over visual go studio for my case I need to refresh my bash to make it uh, Butter app run. So in here, in the Visual Code Studio, um, you click here. You see here no device, uh, which means you cannot run the, the the app. So when you click here, no device, and then you click, um, you can choose uh, the em emulator, the stimulator for Android and iOS to run your app. For my case, I'm gonna pick iOS stimulator so it's waiting it's it's it start up the stimulator here as you can see the stimulator I'm gonna drag it put it and after you see this iPhone 11 Pro or whatever your uh, stimulator that connected to you can type here Flutter run to run your app inside your stimulator. So in here, it quite take long a while. So I'll pause the video and I'll get back when the app is running. You click here, Flutter run. You're gonna have this command. Um, and then you can see your simulator here's your app congratulations you just create your first app um, uh, for further further video I'm going to explain you uh, what is what are the folder inside uh, what are the things inside the folder and what what folder you need to work with um, inside your project in order to get it um, done so i'll see you in the next video bye stay safe and peace